How to Activate Your Hormones Hormones are the master switches of your body. If your hormones are at the right levels, you are protected from disease and aging. We highly recommend getting tested for the major hormones, insulin, thyroid, progesterone for females, testosterone for males, estrogens, DHEA, growth hormone, vitamin D, yes, it's a hormone, adrenaline, norepinephrine, and cortisol. Hormonal imbalances can lead to obesity, depression, most forms of cancer, diabetes, aging, infertility, mood swings, heart disease, sleep apnea, and high cholesterol. Yes, high levels of estrogen are usually a major leading indicator of cancer. Hormones are amino acids mixed together with fat. That's why getting enough protein and incorporating healthy saturated fats like ghee and coconut oil into your diet is highly important. Getting your hormones topped up might take a few months of doing the right activities, proper sleep, stress reduction, nutrition, and exercise. We already covered water, sugars, stress and probiotics in other lessons, so let's take a closer look at exercise. Exercise increases insulin sensitivity and leptin sensitivity. It reduces stress, lowers cholesterol, increases metabolism, body temperature, cardiovascular rate, and burns calories. When choosing an exercise routine, please don't focus exclusively on cardio and aerobic exercises as most people tend to do. It's true that long walks boost our endorphins or happiness hormones and have tremendous effects on our bodies, but too much cardio and aerobic activities can wear you down too. Oftentimes, sprinters are more physically fit and look healthier than marathoners. So model their approach and aim for short spurts of intensive effort followed by rest intervals. Sprinting for 30 to 60 seconds and then resting for 60 seconds dramatically ramps up your human growth hormone production. Growth hormones increase lean muscle mass, decrease fat, promote strong bones, increase immunity, and speed up healing time. Our bodies were not designed to swallow hormones, so teaching your body to generate them through the right exercise is the best way to restore our health. Fasting also stimulates growth hormone production because the body can stop producing insulin since it doesn't need to regulate blood sugar levels anymore. Strength training improves your looks, performance, muscle mass, and metabolic rate, helping you burn more fat. Heavy weights and low repetitions are particularly useful to stimulate the release of testosterone, a very useful hormone that acts as an anabolic steroid. Don't forget to stretch after you are done with your weights. Another great form of exercise is rebounding. Yes, that means jumping up and down on a mini trampoline. It burns 15% more calories than jogging without putting stress on your joints. In fact, rebounding works out every cell muscle, and organ in your body evenly. The trampoline subjects the body to gravitational pulls ranging from zero at the top of each bounce to two or three times the force of gravity at the bottom, strengthening each cell. It's a great fun way to reduce fat, detox, stimulate blood flow, and clear your lymph and increase the efficiency of your immune system. Rebounding oxygenates your blood, improves your balance and flexibility, restoring youth to your muscles and joints, and when properly done, is safe for seniors and children alike. Start using these tips and you will soon be impressed. For more awesome health reports and videos, add us on Facebook at www.facebook.com slash sacred eden. That's www.facebook.com slash sacred Eden.